So I'm about to pick up my son, but I had to make a video because do y'all remember when I made a video on Sunday talking about positive divergence was forming? I swear I put out a video this weekend telling you all that a run should come. Drop a like before we get started. We are up over 30% on the day. We touched into the 30s. We did not get quite to 31 cents, okay? If you've been following this channel, I updated you, I sold at 39, I bought back in at 34, and then I bought more at 27 the other day. I didn't catch the bottom. I told the Discord 25 cents, looks like a full Fibonacci retracement, and we should turn around from there. I guess I was wrong because we touched the low 22s, and then we started to run. Hey, first of all, no one's gonna catch the bottom, no one's ever gonna catch the top, so don't get it twisted. I'm here showing you technical, showing you news of what actually is happening with Mullen Automotive and what is going on with the charts. By the way, the video I put out on Sunday is right here. So subscribe if you're not subscribed yet because then you get notified of my videos right away. If you wanna join the Discord, it's $5. Links down below, you get to join the community. I have a bunch of smart people and we get to connect and really work together to figure out what's going on with Mullen, what's going on with these other stocks. But if you wanna learn more about the chart setups, and everything like that with stocks. It's $10 a month, link is down below. Thank you for everyone that supports the channel and that is locked in to this community. We're almost at 100 million of volume on the day. It's 11.45 a.m. Pacific Standard Time as I'm making this video. And I think tomorrow is gonna be good as well. You can see volume right here, almost 98 million. We opened at 22 cents this morning. We hit highs of 30, almost 31 cents and our low on the day was 22.4. You could see this massive rip earlier today, right? Before even 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. But what's interesting is we're actually holding and we're making higher lows right here. Now, this isn't the actual chart that I usually show you. Can't really do that right now. But also this is looking like maybe a bull flag is forming on the one hour. Um, I've updated the Discord on what I think is going to happen. And I'll just say it here. I do think news is gonna come out. News got to come out after hours today or pre-market tomorrow. That would make the most sense on why we ran today. Another reason why we ran was positive divergence, which I called out on Sunday. I said, this is looking like what's going to happen is we're going to move up because that's happened before, right? Stock price moves lower, RSI makes higher lows. And the other indicator is on the one hour time from the RSI was at nine, nine, which is super, super oversold. As we wrap up this video, I just wanna let you know that Bam Investor, over 100,000 followers on Twitter, has posted again, and Mullen's obviously up, and he said, he's been saying lately he's long on Mullen. I think he does calls on Mullen, which makes a lot of sense. If you bought calls, you're probably up a killer today. Um, but his hidden level is $11. He's been talking a lot about his hidden level. Now, $11, it's possible, it's doable, I guess. I think it's very unlikely in the near future. I think Mullen needs to get through a lot of hiccups, a lot of problems that we've been talking about on this channel and that you see all over the internet, okay? I'm really looking at the Keltner channels right now to be able to trade this stock in the coming days like this week and maybe even the next couple weeks. But we need news. Again, the rip was probably from the RSI uh, being so low the positive divergence forming or because news is coming after hours or tomorrow morning. As always, don't forget to drop a like so we can get this out to more people. I appreciate you all that have been following this journey. And to all the haters out there, I appreciate you too. Thanks for watching the content. See you on the next one.